Hey everyone and welcome to Number One E-Juice. We are a UK vape company with only one goal, to provide you with the best e-liquid and hardware from around the world. In today's video, we are very excited to unbox the latest Capstone RDA, designed by Vape Happy and manufactured by Vandy Vape. On the front, you can see the Vandy Vape logo with Capstone RDA printed, along with the Vape Happy logo. And on the bottom, you have your nicotine warning label. The Vandy Vape logo printed on the side and the same for the other side. On the top, you have your manufacturer contact information along with some warning information on the left. On the bottom, you have your scratch authenticity code, which you can submit to vanityvape.com and simply input the code to see if your product is genuine. You also have a quick response code scanner here on the left, which links to their social media. So go check them out and give them a follow if you haven't already. You then have extra information regarding color, which in this case, we chose to demonstrate the gold version. You didn't have the batch number, ECID number, and the serial number. On the back, you have your key key features which we will go over in just a bit. Now upon opening you are immediately presented with the entire content layout. You first have this brilliant little invention for easy measurement and cutting off the ends of your coils for a perfect fit to your atomizers. Now for the capstone RDA it's already labeled for you. Now before we get into the good stuff let's see what's remaining in the box. Behind the foam layer you got a set of fused Clapton coils for a recommended wattage output of 40 to 50 50 watts. A good looking pair of coils. Not sure if this was machine or handmade. Next, you have your bag of spare goodies, including a 510 pin, so you can use this on a regular mod. Some springs, which means you probably will lose one eventually, as this is a spring loaded deck. You have a lot of spare rubber o-rings, a top screw for the entire deck, and a multi-tool screwdriver. Next, you have your quality control pass certification to say that this is at its higher standard before leaving the manufacturer. And you then have your user manual in eight different languages. So if you speak any of these, you should be covered. Pretty straightforward. Now let's get to the good part. Now the top cap has definitely got an appealing style with the pyramid grooves all around. The inner cap has a different section of all levels for the airflow. Now that works with dual coils or single coil configuration. The top drip tip is a 510 that comes pre-installed in the box with the 510 adapter. You also get a white knurled 810 Delrin drip tip in the box. I do prefer this over the yellow one 100% and I'm glad they went with this color. You also have a PC or polycarbonate cap which is absolutely awesome. I love it when transparency type atomizers are able to show off the vapor production inside. The one thing to mention is that on both caps, you do have a small indent where the atomizer sits flush onto the deck. This is there because the airflow is precisely lined up with the cap. So you never need to adjust your cap. So your airflow holes sit beside the coils. Now this is there to help also to screw in and unscrew the atomizer as it grabs the entire deck. And it makes it much easier. Just like the VGOD Pro Drip or the Drop RDA, they are all very similar. Now this actually works flawlessly and definitely holds a good grip when undoing your atomizer. And last but not least, you have your fountain style deck. You can see the squonk holes on each side. That's where your juice will come from and make contact with the cotton very evenly. I have never seen a deck like this before, but let me tell you, it works great and wicks very well. Now for drippers, when you replace the squonk pin with a regular 510 pin, all you need to do is drip on top and let the deck do the rest. It will just run down like a fountain and saturate your cotton efficiently. To put your coils in, just simply unscrew the top screw, but not all the way, just enough to expose the gap for your coils to slide in. You don't want to unscrew it all the way as there is a spring that has pressure and it will shoot out along with all your components so good luck putting it all of it back together when that does happen it's not fun the well is reasonably sizable and you also have room underneath the pyramid type construction so you actually have more room than it looks now on the bottom you have all your laser engraved logos and serial number information the beauty of this is the o-ring sealer i can't stress this enough but this is an amazing idea most devices out there break because of 
of the access juice that leaks out onto the mod and right into the 510 connection. Now sooner or later they do eventually break due to liquid damage but this actually prevents it from getting inside and onto the logic board so big props for that. Now overall the Capstone RD8 is a magnificent piece of innovation that comes in four different colors gold, black, silver and rainbow. Probably more colors will be coming eventually. So guys that brings us to the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it and found it informative. Give us a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you really liked it. Comment if you have any questions or concerns. We are always here to help. And as always, hope you guys have an awesome day. This was Number One E-Juice.